It's gonna be sure, man. Oh, what's that she? Hello, everyone. My name is uh, Malik. I go by Milky J. You can follow me on Instagram and Twitter, underscore Milky J. Um, a long time Faust player since 2015. Uh, recently switched to Sin January. We're commentating this uh, tension post with my teammate and brother in here, uh, the Tank Data, Team Data as well. What's up, y'all? I'm the Tank. You just call me Will. Uh, I'm still still a kid around these parts. Been playing for a little bit over two years these days. Rock and soul down here in Georgia, but putting time in with some other characters. Let's wait the next version. So, today, I believe our first match is going to be Furok versus Krakatoa. Furok, as you see on the stream right now, Jacko, not a very represented character, especially in the U.S., uh, really not even in Japan either talking with some buddies who just got back from Japan. They played over there for KSB. Said there were only like three Jackos on the cabs. Hey, and then, uh, yeah, I, I, th I think she's like literally the least popular character in Arcade. I'm like going by the statistics. From the, Sounds right. Yeah. Faust, Faust, on the other hand, is like top, top three or top five most common characters in the game, for sure. In America and Japan. Also, just an incredibly strong character in general. Got a lot of space control, uh, fantastic RPS options with those items. He can just change situations immediately. Uh, and then, as far as this matchup goes, I think what we're gonna need to see is if Farrakh can get started while keeping Faust at bay. Um, Jacko's defensive options, not the best. She has to spend resources to DP. And while that may not matter in the short term, uh, she doesn't always get a knockdown from it if it's not a counter hit necessarily. Mm -hmm. uh, so Faust is going to be able to go back in, get that space that he wants. He's got long pokes to go in and keep her from setting houses at safer-ish distances. As long as, um, so I think this matchup, I, I do think as the versions have progressed, you know, with Jacko getting nerfed and um, Faust getting, you know, more buff, it's become more of a, like, kind of close to evenish, probably, I would say even slightly advantage Faust and I say that because you know once Igus uh, shield gets out there it, it really becomes like a lot of Faust's tool set becomes null and void so it's really kind of hard to, for him to deal with and also uh, Faust has to really look out for 3H and like instant blocking that whenever he gets a chance because you know to get, to get those uh, punishes going on yeah, and, and his punishes aren't that great right yeah, because his fastest, his fastest frame, uh, his fastest start frame is uh, well, normal, is seven frames. So that, that's yeah. a lot. Yeah, it definitely keeps him from getting punishes at ranges where uh, three H can even on instant block sometimes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and I soul I, is go go ahead, Silva. And from when I used to play this matchup, um, three H like can challenge some Faust normals that like a, a lot of characters have trouble like dealing with at all, like head on, like far slash and. 2H, it actually can just like stuff them out, right? With far slash, yeah, it just like goes under, switch. obviously. Yeah, like there, there's barely anyone who can like actually just like challenge 2H the way she can. It's really good. Yes, you know, boys, you are on time. We're sick so, of <laughs> so yeah, that's pretty much uh, that's that's definitely my perspective on the matchup now, and I have played it in like every iteration since the character's been released, so. <clears throat> it'll, it'll be interesting to see. I, I actually have not heard of Krakatoa, but I know for a, for a long time as a Melty player, and uh, I actually played him in a set recently before, um, prior to Super TSB, and um, before my, my, my final uh, debut with uh, with Faust, and he he has some knowledge, but when it when it comes to like playing players who are comfortable. In the matchup, he definitely shows signs of like getting a little nervous. So we'll see if that we'll see if that oh, you know what Krakatoa will bring to the table as far as knowledge matchup and just being able to stay on top of Jacko because you you can like her weakness. What I feel what her weakness is is like once you if she doesn't get started, then it's really hard for her to deal with like you know the the aggressive nature of the game. Absolutely, this character needs to work towards her doomsday. Uh, otherwise, she's just a pretty below average character like she has some pokes there her pressure i mean she's got some plus frames and uh she has 
far to spin plus frames at a, or to get plus frames at a safe distance, but not too overwhelming unless those goons get on top of you. Uh, that being said, Faust does have relatively poor defensive options, uh, especially since some of Jacko's really plus buttons and, and pressure buttons are really low uh, total duration. Yeah, she can um, she can deal with a uh, 5D wake up and 6P throw as pretty well. That's exactly where I was going with that. <laughs> so you know it's a, it's a you know it's a it's an RPS of mixing up between like fuzzy jumping and using those options and just seeing if the fast player knows the strings. Pretty excited. I haven't been on tension post in a while. In about one minute. Good yeah, to see some matchups. I, I got to play. <clears throat> so, um, are we waiting on anyone else, or what's? Uh, uh, I, I I was just letting you keep talking before I told them to start. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Well, <laughs> I mean, I mean, you, I guess, you, you you guys uh, were actually like breaking down the matchup really well, so <laughs> that's good. Oh, thank you. So yeah, uh, I think um, Frog definitely has the advantage because um, as we were discussing prior to this, uh, before the set started, Frog is a uh, TSB a Princess Edition champion, beating um, uh, I want to say it was Panda Bet. I know he beat Panda Betic or uh, Native Impact. I'm, I'm, I'm not 100 percent certain, but he won one of his tournaments. Shout out to Native. Yeah, shout out to Native for real. Seriously, shout out to everyone playing this game too. <laughs> still, but um. So I would say if there's anyone that's an underdog, it would be Krakatoa. But who knows? Maybe there's something I don't know that he's yeah. been up. Because Novo was telling us beforehand that uh, Krakatoa is somewhat of a tech god. He's been seen in the Palace Discord a lot, so we may see some real interesting stuff coming out here. That was a good instant block. See, now that situation is kind of bad, but that was a good uh, scalpel pull from, uh, from Krakatoa. Yeah, just staying on top of the houses, just killing them, not really letting them get set up. Strange clash. Wonder if that was intentional or he just failed the house set. But Farrakh showing knowledge right there um, with, with with the string with Faust trying to two s in between the counter hit. Okay, crack the toes. He's, he's he's getting started, man. All right. All he right. did a really all right. Oh, gets hit by it. He wasn't committed uh, to anything, so maybe a miss input on an FD or something. Getting a little bit of uh, incorrect inputs, but uh, I was gonna say not really costly, but. This is 5 confirmed. pressure was also pretty opportune right there. At the time, Jacko didn't have even 10 bar to get the faster version of her DP. Faust could have been safer on some more stuff, but uh. So, something I, I definitely noticed while I was playing Korok, uh, for as Faust, he is kind of free to 6H, six, six like, even offline. Like, I, I don't. I don't. I'm pretty sure he plays the savior, I want to say, but. Maybe 6-6 six, six is just a tool that just gets him, but as you can see with Kraken Katoa, he just finished that last round out with 6-H. So maybe he, he's going to keep that in the pocket. Yeah, Clash, nice. Oh, base to DP, gets a punish. Uh, doesn't really go for the sweep combo, but he goes for the uh, FDC overhead. There's a block on the 6-H and not a pickup, though. It's a... Uh... Pressure. A little bit concerning. Maybe Krakatoa, just, just you know, first round, second round impressions. Maybe not the most aware of what kind of extended pressure or special situations he gets with his items. You know, we saw the drop on the scalpel pull to the poison. May not be a big thing in the long run, but we'll see if anything works out better or worse for him from that. Could have been, you know, it could be connection. It could be nerves. This is the first game, you know, and they're all... Yeah, definitely. They definitely want to play the best of their abilities and definitely understand that. Nice counter on um, big jump D from Krakatoa. He's showing good awareness except for that, like, bomb bags like that and that, that approach. You, you can't really approach Jacko like that when she has I get shield up. That new buff on the uh, air going my way makes it really difficult to challenge uh, post -two J2K options. And we saw that hit right there leading to this situation. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, Farrakh, he, he's, he's kind of finding the rhythm. Some some wasted movement, I'd say. Ah, Krakatoa not really ready. Didn't actually have his Aegis back, so he got the new cooldown move, which is uh, not good in the least. There you uh, go. Krakatoa. Just destroyed the houses. Not a he good look. He's opting to kill the houses, but he should have just kind of... As Faust, you just want to put her in the corner. Like, you don't don't want to set up for items because this situation <laughs> Yeah, Your rare yeah, footage yeah. of Jacko 6P actually working. Yeah, now, now, now is now is that time. Oh, he wakes the super. He's got to be right. Control super. Oh, yeah. No, he's dead. doesn't even try. 
or maybe he just misinputted. That happens sometimes. People forget Faust has that super. So. Oh yeah. Maybe that's so looking very strong. So I think I definitely think he was looking up footage of Bora, or at least playing this matchup. If he's Canada, he probably plays the B Meister, and B Meister is a very competent Jacko. You know, for those that don't know. Say, in my opinion, uh, Krakatoa has done a really good job of keeping uh, this is Jacko, uh, in spaces where she just can't freely set houses. Scalpel pull, far slash, been real good tools, but this round not going the same way as the last three. Yeah, Jacko's getting to play now, and this is uh, bad. This is bad news, bitch. Okay, yep. Minions, meaties. Oh, Blitz, nice. No. He, he's got the he's got the life lead. Well, not life lead, but he's got the round. You know? Yeah, he's not opting to go for a uh, two three six S and then going to my way. I, I kind of don't like that. He, he's he's prioritizing houses. I understand why, but yes, he's right here where you're within like two hits it's not a bad idea to just go ahead and try and kill jacko yeah just put her in the corner man just just put her in the corner then you do okay like and hopefully it's definitely a bad idea to let doomsday get going but there's a certain point where it's not worth it to kill the houses like hitting jacko is the best way to keep things from getting worse especially if she's not even started that much so that's like that's like game time right there you can just if you can just prevent it all completely yeah now he's teching into our buttons his 6p is air and bowl and he's getting a little impatient and four off is really capitalizing it throw mash not really expecting it but that was good though he can afford he can afford the challenge like that scalpel pull for off not really ready Close situation kills the house that scalpel pull doesn't hit the k house but he's gonna kill it on the oki right here or chooses not to. That's actually more dangerous than I would like. I know Jacko's in the corner, but every time... Ooh, nice confirm. He's out. Yeah, that bomb's gonna oh, hit. Yo. not aware. Didn't see the items coming out of the old super. Yeah, uh, Furok was kind of... He's kind of sleeping on the wheel on that. I think he should take a little breather. I'm not sure about that, because he started gaining control towards the... Uh, the, like the middle of that last uh that third round but just couldn't close it out krakatoa getting some scramble situations working for him yeah See on the that. other hand he was looking not too bad in the second and third rounds of that last game so maybe he wants to ride the momentum uh, i'm sure he's aware that this is a first seven so willing to take yeah. the time make those guesses but you know uh, thing about a long set like this though is if a player gets momentum like especially if they get like three games it it's really hard to come back, like it, 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 straight up, because the other player is completely confident in what they're doing, and they could be right wrong. But it doesn't matter because they're gonna, you know, their their oh, intuition so of risk reward is gonna be like, like different because they're like, well, everything I've been doing has been working. Yeah, they get some data. Mm, data is the big right. part of a long set. Nice confirm from Furok. Okay, he's in there. Okay, we got nice. two houses out, one level two. It is the S house is level two, though. I know that Faust does go to the air quite a bit for his defensive option. He That's might for, like, be dead. Instant nice. 2K. But, uh... Oh. Yo, bust out. Whoever's right wins here. Oh, uh, well, Krakatoa is just... to be the he, round for Krakatoa. He is being, a, like, an optimal Faust player with all this... Everything is going his way. Oh, sick. Going my way. Looking to get his third game really quick too. Nice two S from four off of where the spacing. I don't know. I'm having difficulty. Like, is is this intended or is he just screwing the S uh, the S house set and just getting lucky? I, I it's think he's like three around. times. So I'm like, that is very opportune. No guard break. Really, all this stuff going on in the corner is far from opportune. Yeah, Faust has some of the best corner pressure in the game, period. Like, especially when he gets a good item. Oh, nice confirm. Oh, there we go. Oh, Unlockable. Heat stuff. Yeah. Oh, it dropped too far, but it doesn't matter. Oh, man. Oh, unblockable. Wow. Meaty 2K. So, oh, Krakatoa is going to go up 3-0 right now. I'm um, still not sleep on uh, Furok at all, but he did, yeah, he needs to take a moment. There we go. There's the moment we're looking for. Mm-hmm. Because he, he's having a good idea of what he wants to do and where he wants to be, but just not really capital, you know, capitalizing on the situations that's given to him, especially, like, when he gets his, um, his Oki started. Because he'll get, he'll get like, um, minions on top of Faust and stuff, but just can't close it out. Yeah, I'm not wanting to say that this matchup is, like, totally unplayable, but it seems like Furok is going to have to be pretty perfect if he wants a chance. 
Krakatoa is showing that he definitely knows more than, you know, than what people might have anticipated, you know, that, that don't know him. The people that, you know, know him probably know, like, yeah, he's studied. So good stuff to him. No drill. He could have could have definitely gotten a drill combo, but again, it's net play. So, and, and, and honestly, there's still some nerves shaking, probably. 6-H. This is close to round. Uh, 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 weird. Weird stuff right there. Yeah, DP. You're about to lose. Okay. You have to throw a reset. Meaties. Oh, nice. again. Okay. All right. Oh, uh, yeah. 6 feet uh, throw us. Why not? I was about to say, have we found Krakatoa's weakness? Is he too willing to sit there and block? Or the um, I, six feet through? <laughs> so from what I, what what I've been seeing, okay, maximizes damage. So, oh man, bro, I gotta get those, man. You gotta get those, baby. Come on, man. Can't waste that time sitting back there. Mm -hmm. I actually think, well, he had an Aegis field covering all the houses. There would have been no harm in just sitting there, gaining meter passively. Uh, going in may have been a mistake, but... Put a crack of tone out on her, nice. Good delay tech. That timing was actually, uh, if, if he was going to do it, that was like the perfect... Go! Alright, good recall. Saves those houses. This round is looking real good. 3H anti-air. Shoutouts? RC super? Okay, nice. Okay, let's go, let's go. He's dead. All right, Trump, trying to get on the board. That round was pretty clean. <laughs> no 2S. Okay, all right. The slow DP, I think, may have actually been better right there. Yeah, but you still want to, like, that's a, so that's a button. Yeah, 2S really gives us problems as far as if he's just jumping and approaching in this wow. matchup. Uh, 2S is one of Jacko's best buttons by far. It's totally disjointed. Mm -hmm. that, there you go. I is incredibly early. Oh, that was a good confirm from Krakatoa, though. DP and RC hey. dead angle from Krakatoa. Yeah, he's keeping he's keeping it pretty compact. Just trying to you know maximize every opportunity you can get, even even if it's not the most optimal, but it, it's it's his optimal, if that makes sense. Oh, that was not the best bad. first point there. Yeah, he could have got really punished for that. I don't even I think Three H would have comboed at that point. Right? Um, that is one of the things that is absolutely necessary when you learn how to fight Jacko. Knowing the ranges where she can and can't combo, so you can learn about RPSing after the far slash, or just buffering that instant block after the far slash. Nice dust from Furoff, you know. These, uh, Krakatoa's had to block in the minions and just taking everything. So, no tech. All right, just taking it all right now. All right, 2K, get rid 2K. of the minions. Oh, it does not block it. Good burst, good burst, that was perfect. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Put your Igus up. Put the Igus up. See? Nope. See? See? Should have put it up. I don't know if he would have had the space because Aegis is... He would have lived, though, because the flames, remember? Like, it was on the ground already, so he should have just prioritized that while he was away. That's, and that's the thing that gives a, 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 a hard time with this matchup. Like, as soon as Jacko gets that Igus out there and gets the space, like, like see right here? Set up you gotta think that Yes, Faust items are strong and they're projectiles for the most part, but some of what's good about him, or what's weak about Aegis Field, as strong as it is, is that it does take time to deploy. And mm -hmm. every little bit of time counts when you have a character that can reach out and touch you from three quarter screen. So that is I, true. I don't know if uh, it would have just been a better situation just to FD out. I mean, yeah, in that situation, if he wasn't confident, yeah, FD out would. But Krakatoa, he's kind of riding his momentum, baiting all the, well, bait, yeah, baiting the burst again. I would say that Krakatoa is feeling pretty confident at this point. Yeah, I don't think there's anything that Furrow could do to really like this way him except for this. Okay, all right, well, that's cute. We'll see. Let's go. That's let's very go. cute. <laughs> oh yeah, this extended. Yep. All right, cool. All right, what you got? Gonna knock down. All right, yeah, yeah. Super wow. Y R C. Two K. The, the, ne the next one. Not not, not just super, super YRC then throw. <laughs> so it's like you didn't see it, but now you see it. Krakatoa is showing, uh, he's definitely prepared for this match. What, gold burst, yo. Gold burst, there you Shout go. Shout out to A3 Religion. 
I think Krakatoa is doing a good thing right here. Just chilling out, waiting out the Aegis field. Level 1 goons aren't that scary, especially when they're across the screen from you. Yeah, Krakatoa is not respecting anything, really, because it's like, why? I'm just going to kill these houses. You know? Kills the K-House. This is definitely one of the more annoying ones for Faust. Uh, some of his points go over it. Unblockable. Unblockable. Another unblockable. Another unblockable. <laughs> Oh, the door? Oh, count mm, it. 2S, too late. That was good. That was good of Farrakh to not burst. And good DP. Okay. All right. It's your chance. What you got? Ah, uh, see, see, see. Here you go. Got it. Still that it could be the end of the round, so he's not going to spend too much time killing that K-House. Farrakh has got to wake up on his awareness. That's the thing that's costing him. Because Krakatoa is noticing that, and, and, and once, like, it just seems like once Farrakh's starting, um, starting to doubt, like, his decision-making, Krakatoa just kind of is like, oh, well, I'm just, I'm going to run with it. That's, that's been kind of the story of every game I've noticed so far. Gotta, gotta hit him up with the exclamation point roll-up. Shout out to your boy, Shot. Shout out to your boy, Shot. Everybody in chat, drop an exclamation oh. point roll-up. Roll-up. You already know people that know me that know me, but anyway, Slow DP. we got the scaffold and the two S and this uh, danger time, everyone's favorite time. Nice block on the drill on uh, the dive kick. Oh, counter hit! Oh God, mortal counter. Two K. Oh, nice confirm. Wake up, super. All right, DP works. <laughs> uh, not. No! Oh! Um, oh. No, it drops the combo after it. Good lord, we're just smashing Yo. buttons. Yo, some operate is happening. <laughs> uh, that was supposed to be 5D YRC, maybe? Yeah, I, don't, I don't know. More than likely. I, I've never gotten that trying to do whatever. You know, everyone it puts different buttons. I right. could have no. made that burst safe. Probably. Girl. No, that was... That was... That just that was not worth it. Like, Almost so Cal burst, but uh Krakatoa has too little life. I'll let that. If he had like 75 meter, I could okay, get the candy bar. Get the candy bar. Oh no, create, create. No. You should have RC'd that. Oh no. See now you don't got no more I guess. Now you just gotta deal with this. Okay. Another thing I'll say, Farak doesn't seem super in tune with the timing of his minions. There's some things that you can and can't do on offense based on whether you know a minion's gonna swing afterward. Uh, and this is time out right here. It's hard for Jacko to close this distance and get the hit. Yeah, Krakatoa doing the Steve H style. Just, all right, I got the lead. Let me sit on it. Yeah, Krakatoa's looking really strong. I was I was definitely expecting him to be the underdog, but <laughs> maybe, maybe, I don't know, maybe I just spoke too soon. I definitely don't feel like right now Farrakh is playing his best game. Like, or maybe it's, or maybe it's the fact that it's a different type of Faust player that he's fighting against, and he's having trouble adjusting it. You know, adjusting to it. Yeah, and it could be nerves as well. But I like right. the RC. Just spend some time, let the houses level up. Uh, okay, DP. P house looking a little bit low right now though, and pushing him back toward it. Maybe not the best thing. Nice 5K. Okay. Three now, it's pretty safe. Yeah, see, that's been the biggest difference in this set, though. Like, Krakatoa is taking more advantage of opportunities giving, even if they're not the most optimal, per se, but he's still growing with it more so than, like, than Farrakh has been able to consistently. 5D, yeah, YRC. Super late YRC. All right, yeah, Krakatoa's not going to burst. Nah, yeah. Yep. No not problem. worth it at that point in the round, definitely. Right. He had a level 3 house down there waiting. It's five games up. Like, I'm not going to burst. Yeah. Like, you, have, you have to prove to me you're, you're worth spending my burst. Good burst. It is so hard to deal with drill and footsie range. Uh, so few character set buttons that will hit it as well as be a reasonable footsie button. Uh, oh, God, he just confirms. All right, there you go. Oh, nice. Okay. All right, what you got? Throw some houses at him. The projects. Oh, yeah. Oh, there you go. Yeah, see? Now he's on it. Now he's on it. Now he's on it. Hmm. Yeah, this is a tough time right here for Krakatoa. Yeah. Now Krakatoa has to I fight. I mean, for Rock Riding. No, mm, that was a... That DP was very unnecessary. It's a hardy combo. Drop we dropped those, though. Yeah. It doesn't matter. He killed all the houses, so it's another bad situation. There's <laughs> 
<laughs> Even thinking about the uh, meteor situation. Nice evasion from the scuffle pole. Uh, Only scary thing right here might actually be Chip. Command throw? Um, oh, there aren't that many houses out. Krakatoa doesn't get to confirm off the 2P. There we go. Frock is on the board. Let's go. Game one for Rock. All right. Let's go, Melty Blood. <laughs> Shout out to Melty Blood. <laughs> Shout out to Melty Blood. Shout out to Scrot. Shout out to Shout out. Wow. Wow. All right. I think uh, Farag tried to go in a little bit there at round start. You know, challenge with a button. Maybe five. Nice six me though. Nice six me on the scaffold pull. And you don't gotta worry about this bomb. You gotta get the combo. Ah, uh, get the combo. Two S. Come on, two S. Oh. All right, DP. Two yes. is a very consistent answer for sure. Can't like Faust is not allowed to do what. Krakatoa has been doing all set, like teching into just into Jacko's airspace. That that's never supposed to be. Free. All right, there you go. There we go. Rock is he's looking away. Wake up, guys. Wake up. Shout out to mm. Goku. I'm sorry, huh? Yo, that, that that's that's, that's every that's every Faust player special. <laughs> every American Faust. <house>. Like. <laughs> I saw Elven Shadow do it, and I'm like, yeah, I'm going to do it, and it works in time. <laughs> <laughs> it does. It's really good. Just for the crash that's properties. Wow, cheap. Mm, look at this. Mm. Well, that was sick. If he low, too strong. Blitz? No, oh, pop that thought. Perfect. Seven gold letters. Oh, five gold letters. Corn to Neo. So we're on the, um... Potential game two for four or potential game six for Krakatoa. Please don't burst. Okay. Ah. Nice, there you go. <laughs> Ooh, gets his go. burst, all right. Go. All right, ride this momentum. Now we playing the dirty, yeah. Two S. <laughs> ah. Pay attention. Okay, all right. Krakatoa, nice, Oki. Good to pick the burst. Oh, oh. oh I don't know about Like a five H startup or something. Uh, then you get a scalpel pull for trouble. R slash, yeah, nice DP. Put him in the corner, put him in the corner. That's the move. Squad. Oh, uh, lift, I think that would have been a better place to just clock up. Uh, because yeah, yeah. none of the none of the minions were there, it. so your pressure's gonna be weak at that point. Oh, you didn't have it. Oh, you're right, yeah. you're right. The, the, the Jackal player educating us as, 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 as peons. <laughs> I don't have the, the cooldowns internalized. Oh, I played this character for way too little time. It's on the screen. I know, but I don't want to look at that. It's isn't it? It's K, right? I mean, it's yeah, the green one. K is clock up. Yeah, it's oh, okay. No. It's the green blue one. Green one is explosion. Blue is explosion. Green is clock up. Other way around. Oh, blue. Oh yeah, yeah. That's right. Blue, because you see a little. Fire. I haven't played Jacko in like half a year, so. Oh <laughs> uh, no. I don't see Jacko much. Oh. For rock, please. Pressure. Oh, no. Gets hit by the 6H. Yeah, yeah Farouk is he's, he's free to 6H. Uh, I hope when he Hogan. watches it, he tells himself to never get hit by 6H for free again. Yeah, man. Because that's, like, that's just too much damage about gets off of that. And every, every, I don't care what ethnicity you are, what country you're from, wherever a Faust lands at 6H, they're feeling themselves. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. You're just like, mm, hold this. Yeah, there you go. DP in between that. Should have 2S. All right. Nice, nice air control. 2S, yeah. Wow, there you go. Yeah. Now you can get the game over situation. Mm, mm. Nice. Empty jump. Oh, classic. We got little mans rolling out. 2S. 2S. All right, yeah, you get your point. No cancel. Yep. That's fine. Oh, the minion super has got all that. 2H. Wow. 5K. Uh, yeah, for those of y'all who don't actually know, the, the super is plus, but it's like only plus six. So if you IB the last hit or you just sit there and block it, uh, you have things that you can RPS with. It's not like a totally terrible situation. And something else I've noticed at round start that um, other Jackals would round start with, Farouk has not done round start like 5P or 6P, or even uh, far slash. Because uh, most Faust players, if they don't know how to instant block far slash 3H, 
you can you can just kind of game over them right there because they're not gonna know how to deal with. Uh, I mean, with uh, Jacko, with Jacko scenarios. There's been a, I definitely will say there's been a severe lack of that. From, yeah, he needs to do some more far slash. It was really interesting. Uh, no, no, my eyes just see. I thought that the hammer bounced off of the minion, like it was the the actual hit. Mm. But no, I'm just crazy. It's okay, we all are a little are. I see this trying to clash or just beat the uh, I guess. Cool. But not able to make it happen. Oh, he blocked it. Let's go. Oh, it's over. That's oh, man. That's six. Ah, oh, man. Yeah, for rock I think that was seven. To... Yeah, that's seven. Is it? Yeah, I got the stream pulled up so I can see the numbers too. Damn. Yeah, he's already yeah, quitting I'll... out of the game. Okay. Rip. Yeah, I hope Farouk definitely takes from this um, set to work on just looking at the animation for Six Heavy Slash and just tying it up on opportunities because Krakatoa did good, a good, do a good job though. That was good stuff from um, from him. Very impressive showing. I was not expecting. I was not expecting that score from either, like, either win, but regardless. There's probably some game plan, uh, you know, review that Farad needs to do as well. Mm -hmm. It's it's not, it, it sucks when you have to fight Faust button to button and try and get in on Faust without the minion backup, but maybe you need to get that knockdown first before you can start safely setting up houses. It sucks to say that, and and for your for your game plan to start with directly competing with Faust and your character with inferior buttons, it sucks. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah, that's life. So yeah, I definitely hope Farrakh, um adds more far slash to three H at round start in general, and just work on blocking six um, H because the six H opportunities were they. They really kind of let Krakatoa run, run, like just run away with the whole set, with like all the sets. So, yeah. But good showing the Krakatoa. Hopefully, um, uh, Silva, do you know Krakatoa? If he's going to any events, definitely. If I was to look out for him, I'm, I'm uh, shook myself. I'll, I'll ask him in the chat. He's right here. Actually, maybe he can hear us. But I'll type it in. Yeah, Krakatoa. What, what events are you going to? You know, Combo Breaker, that's what he said. Oh, oh, oh yeah, yeah, so cool. you guys better, uh, See, you guys he's better study up. Got to study up. I mean, he was on a very uh, dominant performance, you know. It's always, and you know that, uh, you know, and... It's not to it's not me being biased or anything like that, but it's always for me be it's refreshing to see other players I've never heard of, you know, put on shows like that. It just you know put on performances because it really shows that there's a there's still people in this game that people might not know of that are grinding it still. Yeah, I've definitely seen people say that there aren't enough new players like picking up the game or at least like coming up to events, and I definitely have been seeing more lately especially in especially uh in new york you definitely can attest to that there's been like so many people who haven't really gone to stuff before that have been coming out like like space boy it's really nice like a, a bunch of yeah, he's a philly player yeah, okay, and, yeah. Uh, in georgia we've had three or four new faces and new names come around you know they're they're learning the game well they, i won't say that they're all at that super new new level but there, there are various levels, and it shows that they've really put some time in on their own, maybe even before they found the main local scene. Um, That's good. Yeah, and a lot, a lot of that definitely has to come from, or at least a lot of the like really new players have to come from Pat the Flip screen. I think he's been doing like a really good job with that kind of stuff. Yeah, he's been making some awesome uh, documents and great community outreach and just great streams to hang around. But now, I think we gotta talk yeah, about we got VR versus Minus. Yeah, I'm not sure if uh, Armando played in tournament in this game, to be honest. It, so, what, if these two have played in tournament? I'm yeah. not sure if they have. No, I, I I doubt it. Minus doesn't travel. The fact that he's going the combo breaker, like, surprised me so much. 
Yeah, it actually doesn't go anywhere. Supposed to go two years ago. He's he's been he's been trying to make plans for stuff for like years now, but stuff stuff always seems to fall through. At least lately. Yeah, he's been the final round. Um, he went the final round like it's twist. So I, I definitely remember that. So it's very possible that they will see each other at CB for sure. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So I guess a little insight for both of these players are uh, the arm. He's uh, you know, for those that don't know, he's a longtime Florida player, a Florida native as well. Played with Eno boys. I'm pretty sure for years now. I'm not sure of any other Enos, but I won't, I'm just gonna, for the sake of assumption in this case, I'm gonna assume he knows the matchup fairly well. And uh, and minus himself, actually in the beginning of Exer, he picked up Ramlethal. And Drunken Chicken, shout out to Isaiah. Uh, he he's a long time Ram with all player as well, so he's played Ram. So yeah. both of these guys have a, a bit of history with knowing the matchup. Yeah, and just, just to just to clarify, uh, the arm moved to Chicago. I I know you specified native, but just so everyone. Yeah, 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 and now the arm is a Midwest player. Uh, yeah, but but both know, of them should have history with the matchup. That's your point. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, I'm glad that you're able to come in here, old man that you are, and talk about this lore from before my time. <laughs> I, I had no idea that Minus had played Ramathal before. Mm -hmm. I thought that he was always an Eno player, so I, I'm glad I mean, that you're... No, 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 wait. No, I, against her, right? No, 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 he's played as her. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah. Because he played a different oh. character, yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah, wow. Well, at any rate, both of these guys are incredibly solid. Uh, Armando plays so many games. I know that Minus, uh, he plays KOF. I've seen him play KOF a lot. And our boy, yep. he met Cutie, talking about it in the chat down there. Um, uh, and I know, you know, I think that these both of these guys can block pretty good. Question comes down to who's gonna guess better on. Yeah, I was gonna say they're both gonna mix each other up to death. Like, <laughs> that's what this is. This is two set play characters with what most people don't consider great neutral by any means, but they have some unique tools that they'd be able to employ against each other. A unique fireball coming from Ramathal's side, uh, and sword sets just to make it awkward to move around for Eno. And then Eno's note filling up a lot of space, uh, and Ramathal is a huge target. She has pretty fast movement, especially her air dashes are fast, but she's fat. <laughs> she thick, she a brown girl. <laughs> Except for Armando's color. <laughs> you know what, he's got a brown, he's got a brown color, so it's all good with me. And, 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 and minus does too, so anyway, got the first game, all right. Oh. There you go. Making use of that new tool from Rev2. Yeah, Arm is definitely one of the uh, one of the few Rams to definitely make use of the uh, the new Ram tools very effectively in high level play. Look at oh. these conversions, good lord! And yeah, look at that damage. <laughs> this is gonna be this whole set. <laughs> so if you guys like seeing explosions, you're in for a treat. Ah, you can't guess that. See you again. That's it. That's next round. Like, you can try. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. Just walks away. Doesn't even give him the chance to burst. But why would he? Five golden letters. All right, we, we might see another reverse perfect or a perfect again. Oh, a corner. Oh no, minus misses up his input. Oh, he's tight. It's like he messed up the uh, hover dash GCL. Mm, good um, OS right. with the um, the 5K and the wire. Both players off the table. No instant block on the last hit of the hat, but it's, uh, it's gonna say it's okay, but it's not okay now because he's back in the corner. Get back to your area. Oh, messes up the mix up. Just gonna RC go for some pressure here. Mine's trying to get a hit, just anything started to just get the momentum going. Oh, yeah. What is that? HDL YRC? Yeah. JP whiffs. I'm looking to take this first that game very ball. strongly, yeah. The fireball is so sick to me. I just love the space that it covers, especially in this matchup. Ramblethal is just cool. Just um, cute. one thing we really got to compliment the arm on is his conversions. He turned pretty much every straight hit into a full combo or a knockdown otherwise. Yeah, he. Armando's definitely a player. Like, yo, if I hit you, like, I'm, I'm, I'm definitely killing you right now. Mmm. In this game, I uh, wonder if Minus is gonna kind of do the same thing. Uh, Eno has access to very simple knockdowns with just random hits into uh, HCL, VCL. So we're seeing. Oh. 
Oh, that, was, that was messed up. <laughs> oh, my God. And I have to fight this this weekend, too. <laughs> I'm excited, though. <laughs> anyway, that's it. Eno's dirty, man. Like, oh, oh. Beats <laughs> oh, a six P throw as. Look at this jumpy, jumpy note. Mm, nice. Nice adjustment there for minus. Absolutely. Kept the pressure on the arm a lot more. Mm -hmm. well, especially checking, checking them in the air with P is doing a lot of work. But the the arm has definitely snipped that out, and he just made the adjustment right there, just like that. Now he's got his set pick going. Set to pray. Does not want to take the left right. Oh, nice air kick. The arm, man. Like, yeah, swords. Put him in the corner. Is he going to super? Doubt it. Oh. Uh, he's probably gonna super. Call the sword. Oh, I think he called the wrong sword or just didn't hit six. Oh, that's so cheap. You can't block that. <laughs> you oh. can try. Oh, sick. Oh, this is this looks like it's gonna be a game two. Oh no, no, that's that's the right. Sorry, I thought that was a game. Anyway, good run. momentum uh, with the sword call and minus guess wrong. And both players have a burst, so. I think this round's gonna be a better off. Who spins the burst first? Okay. Might have spins the burst, not trying to deal with any of that rambling ball, Oki. Okay. Good decision. He's got 25 meter though, but that doesn't matter. Arm gets a conversion. He is making the hurt. He is taking it to the point. Pretty big combo here. And plenty of mix up to come with it. All the big swords. High. Double oh, high. This. Oh god. Let's see what I'm on what the arm's gonna opt for you, super. Dead. This, yeah, that's it. That's Good lord. <laughs> yep. How did this happen? Uh, he got touched. <laughs> he got touched and he got schmixed. So, um, I want to say the biggest difference between pro well, probably like Midas is just like his muscle memory of fighting Ramlethal is that the arm doesn't. So, I'm just speaking purely from a player difference. Like Drunken Chicken, he'll. If you know how he plays, like sometimes he'll wake up and do the um, the other the, like the run, you know the uh, the super, yeah, the ground one, the explosion, yeah, yeah, the, ex the explosion one, explode, yeah. Uh, the arm really doesn't opt for that. He kind of holds his meter and opts for Oki most of the time. So that so, could yeah. be a, a little minor thing, you know, a, a player matchup yeah. thing that could be throwing him off a bit. Reverse from the arm. Are safe jumps, and so he loses a little bit of uh, mix-up prowess from going for the safety. So maybe he needs to recognize that oh, not man. using those options. Change it up. Oh, this is the side switch. He's got he's got 50 meter though in a dream. JD cheap. <laughs> the round might be over. Oh, it's over. Yeah, it's over. That's it. <laughs> Both of these characters hurt. They just got to get the hit. It's a matter of, uh, it's a matter of hitting harder. <laughs> oh, nice confirm. No, uh, minus. Oh, that. Look at that hover dash. That's so scary to deal with. <laughs> yeah, I'm not having any of that. Just cross up low. I think that just disrespect that. Oh, good spacing from the arm. Evading the overhead. I feel like I just saw Minus walk forward after blocking the overhead. Maybe he he was trying to like walk up and throw or something. I don't know. That was strange. I definitely think he was. Hmm. That was that was a good burst. Uh, Minus didn't have 50 meter, so he couldn't have RC. Oh, good six B. Minus overhead super. Oh no. All right, he's gonna kill. Yeah. This game should be done. That's spooky. That is very... Mm. All right, good stuff to minus close it out. Black beats matter. It's a good Black friend Obama says. Invalid combos are combos. In our hearts. Oh, excuse me. Okay. It's, uh... On the board? Be honest, that look like two separate characters dancing around and swinging. I mean, yeah, like <laughs> that's what this that's is. What they gotta do, yeah. Oh, the reset, the arm text, and you know, definitely. So that, so ah, well, if y'all don't know, 
if you, if you get hit by Eno, don't. If you're gonna tech and mash, or if you're gonna mash and tech, do it with with a big purpose because Eno players are definitely looking for the command throw resets. Once they Those get resets you come a lot on the air dash part of the combo. That's also where she uh, she has a link that she can wire COS and then unblock a Mm-hmm. Good. Uh, yeah, making use of that new Ramothal tool. As I was saying earlier, you know, the arm being one of the one of the few Rams really use that. Yeah, it's it's just a necessary way to RPS after jump H. Uh, before all that you do was like jump H set. And it was a terrible situation. But uh, uh -oh. even though this is not great, it gives you a chance. Blocks, good blocks. No, the fails arm. the... Uh, or didn't get the oh. meter, I think. Good throw from Minus, but not... Uh, unfortunately, just a little bit off of the timing with that... Uh, with that VCOYRC. Whoa. Missing some inputs. Yeah, Chaz is definitely not on. I'm not sure what the connection is. I, I don't think it's too bad, though. He should have files. <laughs> it's the Midwest. Good back dash. It's out of the 2D. Yeah. Oh, uh-oh. Uh, baiting sure the burst. There. He's baiting the burst. And he has to spin his burst. Jump peas. E? Trying to get him to block the note. It was actually how uh, Minus ended the round of the first game that he won. Was JP's and we couldn't combo threw that note up. They're both playing Samir. Uh, Samir footsies. Good confirm from Orlando. Oh, no knockdown. Did the best that he could with it. Oh, oh, oh. It's in the mix up. This might be it. Oh, oh that was cheap. Very <laughs> low. <laughs> yeah, block that, bro. Yeah, man. You totally just, block Eno's mix up. Just react to it, man. Yeah, just react. Oh, you can totally see that. <laughs> I don't believe you, MTL Spider. <laughs> you totally <laughs> that. Just react, man. Yeah. It's uh, two up right now. I'm definitely expecting this set to go to last game last week. That type of uh, that type of set, but you know they're both, they're both set play characters, so it could it could go to complete opposites. <laughs> oh, that was tricky. The arm has 50 meters, so <laughs> minus has to burst carefully. Oh, that could that jump H sword summon. Mmm. I for sure thought minus was gonna VLC. See. Oh yeah, arm has to kind of deal with that situation. Okay, nice, nice uh, maneuvering out of that. Uh oh. Pretty good tent to just oh. pull out and approach safely. Didn't take much risk. Now get in the corner. Have fun. Oh, he's dead. Oh, oh this is the link. Yeah, he was definitely dead. Yeah. You're not blocking that, though. Yeah. Anti jump low under that. You're only a human. <laughs> you're, not, you're not an android. Oh. Yeah. Arm is he's kind of calling out a minus his options. That's like, there's been like three counter hits in the span of seven seconds. Maybe he's trying to get like some delay tech buttons. I'm not too sure. I like that. Minus chose not to go for the mix up and just wanted the uh, positioning. Fortunately, it didn't work out for him afterward. But but that six P did. I ran all back in the mix up. Oh! It's that. Good lord. The round is over. You know what? Say goodbye. Next round. <laughs> oh, he's the GS. Nice for the arm. An arm firing right back. That was shoot. The fuzzy? The he fuzzy. Knockdown. Just too much blocking for Minus's taste, apparently. <laughs> oh, you see, again, Minus getting mileage off that uh, that air tech. The arm is going to watch out for that. Good, uh, good super jump up. Just kind of changes the defensive options. Yeah. What a combo. Oh, drops a super jump ID. 
Good person minus is climbing that tree. Psycho Crusher. What? What? You could do that? Oh, oh yeah, no, I'm safe, DCL. Oh, but the arm wasn't ready with that confirm. Killing the sword minus it. Uh, they are both disrespecting each other. <laughs> Give me that. Oh, you are not allowed to backdash on that. The arm should be taking this. Yeah, that's 3 2. Unless your backdash is Sin or Potemkin. Or Hi. Answer, probably. You are yeah, not allowed yeah. to get out of that sword. And so he'd be, uh, he'd be smooth stepping, boy. I love Answer's backdash, man. He just, it, it feels like incredible amounts of finesse just emanate from that man. Too bad he sucks. He's all right. I'm going to say he sucks. But anyway, what does suck was uh, Minus having to spin that burst. Mm, good blocks, good block. Oh, yeah, this, I forgot this. I think that was the first thing that Arm went to the second one. I guess Minus was tired of getting counter hit by the first. But he got hit by that, with that, uh, that overhead. And Arm is definitely looking like he's about to take this round very, uh, very healthy. Good block. No, no, no yeah. <laughs> block. yeah. He ain't blocking that. Can't block that. Yeah, at least these characters are mauling each other to death, you know? Like, <laughs> yeah, I've not been a set play guy, but I love the way that Ramathal's works. Ramathal's cool. Jump H. <laughs> Ooh. That was like layer five right there. <laughs> It really was. I got <laughs> Good burst from minus. So yeah, guard break. Uh, the arm didn't. He didn't FD to get out of that situation. So now he has to deal with the Soki. Super plus frames plus? plus a billion plus don't press I think I, nothing. You can block long enough to block the dead angle and still got a mix up. So maybe minus was just trying to be extra greedy there. I think he just wanted the arm to spend either spin resources or just make him hold Thanks. something. Yeah, equivalent you know. exchange, not too bad of a deal. But that counter hit was not a good deal. And that's going to be the gonna round. Be round for sure. Yep. Dying with uh, almost 75 meter. <laughs> that's going to make the arm go up 4-2. He's looking very strong. He really is. Like he hadn't skipped a beat. I don't recall watching him play GG in a while, but I've been seeing him play Blaze Blue. This man is just a blast to watch. Now he still plays. Uh, I think he still enters at the monthly. Is that especially like a guilty, uh, a guilty garage, the garage yeah, here, yeah, yeah. Oh, garage here. The other, there's, there's another event too that they have. No, that's just still been still me playing. not watching it. But uh, I, I recently saw him play in some tournament with uh, Rachel in Blaze Blue. And that character, no, he, he just makes shine. Oh, nice super for minus. That's big brain. Whoa! If he jump low. So yeah, man, just block that. Totally reactable. You, you can be, you can be 100% right. You can be like <laughs> knockdown. No knockdown, but look at that meter gain. But this is in a good position right now because the arm had to hold that note, and this VL, uh, DCO YRC is very meaty. Yeah, how about it? Yeah, why not? Why not? Why not? Yeah, no respect. Around. Good, good throw from the arm. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna take him to the oil. Not quite dead, even with the super. All right, uh, minus psycho pressure. Okay. Who do you are? Not opting to go for any tech trap. He resets. Okay, nice RC. <laughs> Jump H. Six P. Oh, I, I swore minus is gonna six P right there. Air throw. Air throw. This is looking pretty close. Oh, good. Yep, that's block. a punish. Oh. Trying to keep those swords in control, but that might cost him. one hit both sides. Yeah, he's got shit on both sides. Oh. No YRC. No YRC. Minus staying alive. Keep so taking, good. Um, three four. Staying in the board. <laughs> Doing this with you is pointless. Don't be that way, you know. <laughs> Thank you to anonymous donor for the sub gift. Thank you for the sub gift. It's much appreciated. Yeah, thank y'all for supporting the stream. Attention Pulse is a blessing for the GG community. 
I like that JP, just the stuff. It's a little mm -hmm. soft sign, not active for too long. Mine right. is getting another guard break, or I'm not opting to spend any of his meter. Choosing to hold it, probably for a super. Or any kind of like confirm you might get, because he can, he can afford to take like one more hit, or two more hits. Oh, yeah, that's what he's saving the meter for. That right there. That I was know good JP meter. hits incredibly high, so supposing that he wasn't just holding it for something crazy like that, uh, I mean, that combined with how big of a target Ramoth all is. Yeah, that was definitely yeah. master uh, meter management. Yeah, there it is. There is the explosion. There. It had to come out eventually, right? <laughs> oh, it it's a dead angle. angle. Uh, man. And um, I want to say, um, both of their hard reads look very clean, but the, uh, the arm is just, um, Zard Greens have just been looking very, like, just... They've, they've been de definitely like the, the round sealers. More so on this set, but again, this is a high I'm looking at. High or low? Hi! <laughs> Her air dash is so fast, man. She's almost as fast as Izzy. Or you can go into perfect. Oh! Although, this is a lot of damage coming back from the other side. Oh, I'm going to the knockdown, but this is going to be one, and Yo. we're potentially one mix-up into death. He's or dead. one confirm. He's dead. Yep. What is that, five? OTG explode. Yep, 5-3. Five, 5-3. Three. Five, three. <laughs> yeah, the arms uh, ma meter management in this. Sure. Experience has more value than specs. Oh, swing your hair, Ram. <laughs> Man. So, I, I, I want to say there's not really too many adjustments Midas has to make other than, like, I guess, getting I mean, the situations and then, like, just capitalizing. Like, because right now, yeah, see, this <laughs> this is this is the situation he wants. Let's definitely, I mean, the combo drops between the two of them. Arm has dropped maybe one combo. Yeah, the, the uh, drops have definitely been less on his. Yeah, minus has dropped so many, and yeah, it's true that you know does a lot of damage, but there's a certain point where the knockdown matters more. Uh, so like just this situation. Stuff. Yeah, nothing wrong with keeping. It. Good lord, five P instant JD, and that's gonna seal the round. Yeah, next round. probably. No, <laughs> next round. Yeah. Just so many safe options. Good, uh, that was a very strong round from my... That overhead is plus. Plus anything. Not able to chase in the back dash. That's good looking right there. Oh, empty was... hover dash throw. Good lord. That was really cheeky. Uh, there are so many layers. Good lord. Oh, he's getting smixed. Help, help. Oh, no, jump H. A <laughs> little bit of neutral. Oh, that jump H hits so strange when it doesn't hit as early as possible. And that's happened a couple of times uh, earlier in the set when Armando would take an air combo where he can't get a knockdown. He'll go for the Rekka Enders just to get that meter. And uh, Minus didn't tech out, got black beaded on most of them. Finally started teching, so maybe Armando wants to just stick with the one. Chaz, I'm gonna need you to close this round out and not get scooped like that. Oh, no. Not gonna happen. <laughs> Chaz! <laughs> Command throw, not the best starter, but had enough risks there to take that round. As soon as I started thinking it, he got scooped. <laughs> I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna just. <laughs> I'm gonna just be the neutral ground again because I was like commentator's like, curse, man. <laughs> yeah, it, it was commentator's thoughts curse. Oh, nice, uh, nice guard break again. The pressure. Plus ah! frame. Oh, yeah. ah! oh no. no, he got oh, R slash instead of six S. Super. Oh, yo, he should. I want to say that he was trying to do six S, but maybe he, he want to walk up the close slash. I thought he was gonna let it rip, yo. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> J2D says, don't air throw me. Mm. Uh, oh, 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 
Uh oh. He's dead. He's dead. Black Pete. Oh, he's nice. Dead. What next? Oh, dead angle. Nice. Is nice. that had been canceled in the VCL, it may have raised Eno up enough not to get hit by the dead angle. Definitely feel like uh, Minus is looking for a burst. Oh, right there. Uh, and our, the RM is going to go up 6-3 or 4. It's 3, right? Yeah, 6-3. It's looking really rough for Chaz, man. Shame. Come on, Chaz. Let's go. So this is set game here for Armando. I don't... I, I mean, I hope that Chaz doesn't pull any desperation move. No, he's a, he's an experienced tournament vet, so I don't think he... If anything, it's not going to be desperation, but more so, like, stuff I... I you know, like... S, uh... S-C-F-N-S. Save that shark for nationals. Uh, <laughs> uh, that burst was a, a not nationals burst, though. Big damage, big combo, <laughs> and great set play. Uh, Left or right? Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, everyone got mixed. I, I, if you say you didn't get mixed, you're lying. Straight up. Hi, hi. Good no. blocks. Super. Yeah, it is. Oh, super, super right back. Oh, oh yeah. frames, oh. mashes out. Yep. So that is something you can do if you got a five frame or a faster five. Uh, if you instant block or just block the move before JD. It depends on the move. You mash 5P. Get out with moderately consistent results. But Arm is sitting on a set point right now. Oh, jumping in. He's just, he's just kind of, he's trying to end it real quick. He's playing like he wants to play some blazing tag real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to make the speed runs happen. Oh no! That's uh, a lot. Of, nice, nice, nice. Okay, just willing to take the chip and the risk. Oh, Ooh, six H. This ah. might be the chance that minus. Tried to hover dash, but got turned around. Yeah, the arm is blocking. Is, I know blocking an Eno is kind of like a. <laughs> that's, it's a you know it's funny to say, but. He, the arms blocks have been one point to set. That's it, man. I was going to say, Minus needed to burst right there because he was going to get OTG explode and not, not survive, but that's it. The arms going to take it, that. Um, it's going to take that over Minus. Uh, P-A-G-T-S-B Minus, a 7-3. Good showing to both players. All right. Yeah, Arm definitely looking strong going into combo breaker. Absolutely. But, you know, Arm is he's a very consistent player, so it's not really a surprise right there. Minus is still strong as well, you know, but um, Arm just, he he had less crucial drops and capitalized more in situations. You know, that's, that's what a lot of high-level play kind of boils down to in any game. Like... Yeah, if, if, if you just, like... Make make the most of like every hit that matters so much. Absolutely. Uh, I mean, I think a sentiment, especially when you're a set playing character that you carry while you're hard, and even as you get stronger in the game, that the knockdown means so much more than the damage at the end of the day. Uh, it's so hard for you to get out when they are literally just guessing. And take, take that knockdown, no matter how simple it is. And and like. Because, uh, a lot of those characters are designed to like not really have strong neutral. So like un unless you're actually getting that hit and like running with it, you're not like making the most of your character. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, their neutral conversions are generally not strong outside of very specific instances. Uh, like Ramathal, if she hits far slash, it doesn't matter unless it's crouch hit or counter hit, and she can only confirm one of those. So that's like one very clear situation that you want to avoid if you're the opponent. And then, you know, she does have some better neutral conversions, but some of them require meter. Like uh, HCL is, is a fantastic poke in itself, but then she's got some uh, air dash after it. And I uh, get a pick up there. 2S has gotten a little bit longer, but it's still short range compared to some of the other characters that have stronger neutral tools. Uh, far slash, super slow, even though it's disjointed. Uh, it's very difficult to use. 
So you're right, not the strongest neutral tools between the two. So when you do get that hit, take the simple knockdown and then get the strong hit from your mix up. That, that's what matters. I think you're such a prey. Well, yeah, definitely some uh, some entertaining sets. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, even uh, even though the scores are a bit lopsided, it was definitely <laughs> nice seeing all those players. It gives us a lot of things to look at and think about, both in the game as a whole and in individual situations. And I yeah. hope that all the players are willing to go back, look at it, and learn. For, for sure. I need to play you. I haven't played you with my son. I'm here right now. I think Silva has to close the show. I'm not sure. Huh? Yeah, it's all good. What you, you, you want to play elsewhere? Do you want to play real quick? Sure. Okay. I can. Uh, we can um, do, you, you can we can do an extra set. Chris to what? Uh, I, I don't know what he's looking for. We can play it's that It's, it's up to you, Silva. It's, it's, it, you know, it's, it's all yours. Uh... Uh, yeah. so, so, something not too long. You want to do three, Will? Three? Sure, I'm down with three. <sighs> okay. Oh, uh, I should be I should be playing Smash because we're going to Smash tournament tomorrow, but I can't resist. Guilty sure. Gear is good, man. Quick, quick first of three before match announcement. Good, hold on. Okay. Whee! <laughs> Ugh. So Silva, um, are you gonna be able to make defend in North? No. Oh, uh, okay. I'll I'll go to ECT, but that's not anytime particularly soon. So. Yeah, that's like in October. Yeah. Yo, what's up, DBC? I haven't seen that name in a long time. DBC Loop? Yeah, DBC Loop. Wow. Not since <laughs> the anime bus, anime party bus crashed. Oh my god. Rip that Discord. My buttons are gonna be loud. I'm gonna be right now. Shout out to Koku, wherever you Shout are. Shout outs. <laughs> always, always having to click in buttons in the background. Ugh. But um, I was looking at some of the results, Will, from uh, whenever all, I mean, uh, from plus two, it was like nine people that showed up. Yeah. It wasn't bad for a side tournament that we didn't get approved until like three days early. That was bad. Uh, I'm getting tickets to oil. Oh my gosh. Oh. Nice. Uh, uh, ooh. Oh, I didn't turn around. Thanks. Uh, what's his name, right? Gun, um, I mean, Grand Roger. No. Oh, wow. That was manly. Kill a player. Oh. I should use burst super, dang it. Oh. <laughs> I was like, I think that's gonna kill? <laughs> you were right. <laughs> uh, that is someone double tapping every button. Yes, that's me. Shout out to the uh, the old man style. Yeah, third strike can confirm. <laughs> Low forward super. Get the piano or everything. I can't, I can't un... Oh no. Uh. You were crazy, and I just had a terrible misinput. You know I'm crazy. <laughs> oh 
Oh, where's my SM5? Uh, hey, 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 hey. Uh, slow, wake up. Ooh. Oh, God. Where's your 6P, dog? I wasn't expecting that. I was just trying to fuzzy jump. <laughs> Here, you have, you have so much meter. I'm not looking at... <laughs> you can gun flame more, RC. I'm not trying to... I'm not trying to deal with that. Oh. Oh. oh! I messed up. I was too low. Oh god. That was definitely where I wanted. Oh, I messed up. My... Ah, I need to go practice that OS more. I can't believe that it's so big. Oh my god. I've been digging that more. Shout out to Dot Nova. Oh. Alright, my sense fraudulent. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I need to get my booty blasted like this. <laughs> well, I've had a lot of practice in this matchup. Yeah, and you play the character too, so. Where's my six feet? It's not like that at all. <sighs> oh god. Whoop. <laughs> uh. I am getting I'm getting really rocked. <laughs> <laughs> This is degenerate. I'm not trying to play flissies with you. He's gonna beat Driver. He just ate. <laughs> I did, but I did the other one. Oh. Oh. Nope. oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Well, we can talk about this. See that, but I was late. <laughs> uh, maximum disrespect. <laughs> I'll get you, you son of a gun. <laughs> okay. The tournament's this Saturday. I'd rather get my ass beaten. I feel nice for that back dash punish there, Bella Sade. Look what he does to his grandson, yo. <laughs> your, grandson's, your grandson's adorable. You just let me let me explain. Ass. Let me explain for the stream why I did that. I knew that he was sweating. He had no bar. I had all the bar. I just made him whiff his big old beat driver. So I had to you, disrespect him. You just shoved your you just shoved <sighs> your your presence all up in his on your grandson. <laughs> How does that make you feel? Bully? Pretty nice. Pretty nice. But I think we have. A little bit more to do where we are in the stream yeah. we so, got some folks for next time right yeah mm -hmm. so this so first of all this thursday we have b-boy dragon and diaphone and zombie and game wizard for bb tag those will be good and that's our last uh three patch stream because the patch comes out next week which means the week after we'll immediately have a patch episode hopefully so that'll be fun but Cool. For GG, next. Sweet.
have Bev versus Space Boy. And Manny versus Sim. Shout outs. So that would be some good stuff. Yeah, th those should be pretty good. We don't have commentators yet. But those should be fun. Sim hasn't played since the very, very, very first episode, <laughs> which oh, wow. was a long time ago. Yeah, it was him and Blacksnake, right? Yeah. No. Uh, it was him. It was him and Bears, because this was when okay. he, this was when the show originally was his idea. He really wanted to fight Bears. Gotcha. Yeah. But yeah. Yo, Steve, I see you with the side bets. Steve, I, 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 I don't have to think about it. No, no, Mr. K. I'm gonna have Someone's to think about it. All right. Well, yeah, uh, thanks nice. everybody for tuning in. Thank you all for tuning in. And, uh, Appreciate it. Please follow, um, please follow uh, Tension Pulse on Twitch. I mean, uh, yeah, on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube. And uh, for me personally, thank you, Silva, for putting these together. It means a lot to me to have uh, the community get together and watch people do their thing. It's very constructive. I know I personally, especially when uh, Deb was he is uh, he's the person I have to beat to become the best soul in the U.S. Well, in America, I'll say. In North America. Yeah. Yeah. Um, thank you, everybody, for tuning in. Come back next time. Come back Wednesday for BB Tag. Thursday. It's a great game. Oh, Thursday. Sorry. Yeah. I'm crazy. Thursday. Oh, Come Thursday. back Thursday for BB Tag. Even okay. if it's not your game, it's a whole lot of fun to watch. Yeah, check it out. Mm -hmm. Even if you don't watch it usually. The Ruby characters. Somebody likes a Ruby character. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Good night.